Welcome back to Dolphins Weekly Live here at Hard Rock Stadium at CBS Score. We look for the best high school football player in Dade and Broward and award the Natmore Trophy every year. I'm joined by two very special guests. Two of our four finalists are here. Nathaniel Joseph, wide receiver from Edison, and Edwin Joseph, no relation, wide receiver from Chaminade, Madonna, joining us now. These are two of our four finalists with Ruben Bain, of course, from Central, and Brandon Innes, the other wide receiver from American Heritage. Uh, Nathaniel, I want to start with you because obviously Nat Moore went to your school. Yep. So what does the Nat Moore Trophy mean to you and your community? I mean, it's a, it's a big and tremendous blessing. And I mean, it'll bring so much back to the community. It'll bring a lot back to Miami Edison. I mean, just being able to to be on this stage and just put on for Miami Edison, put on for my community. I mean, it's a tremendous blessing. And I'm doing this for the community. I'm doing this for my people. I'm doing this for everybody. I'm doing this for the city. Man, we're putting on for Miami Dade County and it's on South Florida. <laughs> Nathaniel certainly having a good year. Ed Edwin, obviously you and Sean also having a good year, but you have some familiarity with this award too, because Kenyatta Jackson was at your school last year won the award. So what would it mean? On off the field, he teaches a lot. So it really show how much we work hard and what Coach Jones, our, our head coach, has going on over there. But it'll be great just to bring that back to uh, South Florida and no matter what, uh, Broward and Sauvignon. So it'll be it'll just be great to, to actually win an award because, you know, having a great season, and it'll just be great to finish it off with a great award. Uh, and Nathaniel, uh, you might be playing uh, at the next level in this building. Uh, tell us what your future plans are right now. Scoring a lot of touchdowns and just bringing back that winning tradition to the University of Miami. So I definitely want to bring back that, you know, that winning mentality and that and that dog mentality that they carried back in the day. So that's definitely all the recruits that's coming in. That's all our goal. Yeah. We want to come in and just bring it back and just and just make it better for Coach Tristan Ball and for that style. So we definitely want to bring it back and win a national championship. And, and, and Edwin, uh, you've got some unfinished business still in high school. I know you haven't decided yet where you're going to go, uh, but what's next for you and your team in the playoffs? Uh, you know, we're just taking it week by week. Uh, right now we're 2-0 in the playoffs. We're going to try to make it 3-0. Uh, definitely win this week go and end up going to states and then other, all the extra stuff like nationals. But, you know, we just win it, take it week by week. You know, uh, that's how you got to take it in the playoffs because that's how you get beat. But, you know, we're just working hard every day and just keep working, grinding hard. How many state titles do you have? Uh, I have one. Uh, I, went my, I went my sophomore year and we <laughs> ended up losing. But I only have one. But, you know, it, I've been there. It's going to be like if we went out, it's going to be like my third year going. Yeah. So it's been great. It's a great program, and I love everything about it. All right. Well, congrats to you both. We'll be seeing a lot of you very short order in the future. Don't forget, you can vote at NatmoreTrophy.com for Nathaniel, for Edwin, for Ruben Bain from Central, or Brandon Innes from American Heritage Plantation. Thank you guys so much for coming here, joining us on the field. This was a lot of fun. I appreciate it. Enjoy the game. Dolphins Weekly Live will be back in just a few minutes.